Hey guys, it's Mr. Wahidul Haq here back with another Amazon package unboxing. Today I'm going to be unboxing this for you. Go check out my last unboxing if you haven't. That was the best unboxing ever. I love the item. I was really surprised by it. Uh, let's go ahead and open this sponsored package. Frustration repackaging and I got it in one go. Damn. I deserve a like for that. Come on guys. Right. Oh, yes. Full, 10 H full HD 1080p dash cam. That's what I like. The sponsor for this video is Terich. Thank you Terich for sending this out to me. And if you don't believe me, there it is on the list. I've ticked it off, 18. As you can see, 18 sponsors just this, just in one day, guys. 18 sponsors, so I'm doing pretty well, I'd say. And then there's, we got E as well. I do like a different list as well, as you can see. We got uh, A, B, C, D, E, that's a different, this is a di basically, the E is uh, my Facebook and the normal numbers, they're like my email and stuff, the ones that contact me through email from watching my channel. So yeah, thank you Terich for sending this out to me, really appreciate it. Let's go ahead and open this. Uh, not much on the packaging, pretty plain. Oh, we got something at the bottom. Full night vision, are you ready guys? I was expecting a bigger package to be honest. Wow. Got a box here. Another box there. Um user manual. Ooh, ooh. And then another box. And you got the email address if you need support. Very nice of them. Nothing else in there. Okay, so there's the product itself. I'm gonna open this box actually. I'm really intrigued what's inside this one. I'm guessing it's some sort of mount. Yes, it is just how I thought. So we've got a mount here for your window, I think. Uh, this is for your window as well. Not too sure. And then we've got a charging cable, flat cable as well. That's really nice. Not seen one of them, and that's a mini USB. Not seen that in a while either. We've got a cloth here to wipe the screen with. And uh, USB. Whoa! Look at that tiny charger. That's a car charger. It doesn't look high quality though. Uh, hmm. I don't know if I'd use that. I've, I have my own anyway, if I want to use it. Look at that, you can see the inside. It's a bit weird. My camera is really bad at focusing. You can see the inside. I've never seen one of them like that in, my, in a car charger. Uh, it's got a rubber outer ring. Very nice, very soft. And yeah, so we've got... Uh, input is one, 12 amps, 12 volts. Output is 5 volts at 2.1 amps. So it's a normal charger. Very small charger though. So yeah, this is powered by the cigarette lighter. So user manual, full, t full HD, 1080p dash cam. Okay, so we've got instruction manual. Okay, we'll do open this first so we can see the product first. Because I'm going to label it out and show you what everything else is. Oh, pulls out like that. Very nice. Look at that guys, holy shit. Wow. It looks like a fucking GoPro. Look at that. Oh my days, look how nice that is. It's like a glass effect at this side. Uh, UV light, flashlight, and then you got the UV ultraviolet, not ultraviolet, infrared one, that's the one. So you can see in the dark. Very nice Sony lens there. It's a Sony lens, by the way. I can remember that. Uh, full HD 1080p to reach. Very nice quality, wow. Got a mount thing there, record button there. It's not on at the moment. Uh, you charge it through there or keep it plugged in. Um, basically, you plug in a reset button there. It's got even a HDMI thing. Holy crap. So you can plug in straight away after an accident and put it in. Or any sim small thing you've recorded. Very good for YouTube, I guess, if you're driving and vlogging. Uh, micro SD card. Uh, what I like about this is uh, it overwrites your last footage until you take it off or stop the recording or get in a crash and it's. It also stops and starts recording automatically. You know when you're driving and stuff and moving and not moving and stuff and when something happens or not. I don't know what these buttons are. Uh, but let's try turn it on. I think you hold this to turn it on. Yeah, I heard, I heard a noise. Not too sure what's going on. Hmm, maybe it doesn't have charge. I'm not too sure. It's a very nice product so far, I really like it. Okay, so one is a micro SD card, 
power on, power on off. So power on and off switch is number two. Let's see that which one dies. Ah, so the red button is the power on and off button like I thought. Maybe you just press it once. No. You definitely hold it, I heard the noise. Hmm. Doesn't seem to be doing much. Okay, power on and off, mountain slot, which is at the top. Lens is at the back, which I've shown. Power USB slot, I've shown you that. Six is recording charging indicator. I don't know where that is. Number six is... Uh... Hmm. Ah, there. Recording charging indicator is there, the six one. Okay. Number seven is recording and okay, which is that. I'm not too sure. Oh, okay. So recording is this one, an okay button. The one below that's mode and return. Number nine is emergency lock. Number 10 is a white LED switch. Where's that? Oh, white LED switch, light. Left, right and mute. And 12 is menu, which is this one. Okay, HDMI, we've seen that. Reset is at the bottom. Uh, speaker, oh, this is a speaker on here as well. Which is somewhere. I think that's at the bottom. Yeah, speaker's there. Three, six grills there. And white fill-in light is number 16. Where's that? Yeah, the bottom one's a flash, like I said. And the top one's a infrared. Okay. Uh, it's got a microphone as well. Front indicator light, uh, yes. Instructions before you use insert a SD card. So you need a SD card for this. When you get a new memory card, please format it. You can take up to 64 gigs. That's really good. I'm definitely going to put this to use. Before formatting, yes. Okay. And uh, do not remove the SD card while saving or reading. Data might be corrupt. Uh, charging, yes, yes. Uh, powered off mode, powered off mode. We didn't say how to turn it on off. Uh, photo mode. Okay, so there's different modes. I'm not going to go through them because it's very difficult without it actually being on. So yeah. The files are encrypted. Wow, you can encrypt files on this. Holy crap, this is amazing. But yeah, you got a lot of systems on here. System settings and stuff. I'm really gonna have to read through this. It's got motion sensor start. You change the sensitivity of that as well. Time lapse recording. Uh, you can change the stuff. It's got parking monitor. Holy shit. Automatically turn on and uh, keep recording from 30. So that's really good. This is a very good thingy. Very good product. I'm really liking it. Let's see what's inside of this one. Because we've already seen the. U what the fuck? What the fuck, guys? So they give a long ass cable as well. I think this is if you're recording from really far away. Say you put it on your back mirror, your back one instead of your front. And yeah, that'll go really far. Holy shit. So guys, I managed to get it working. It's charging at the moment. So when you do put it in charge, I'll show you what it looks like. When you charge it while it's on, it goes orange. Can you see that? And yeah, so it says no SD card inside. So as you can see, it's very wide angle. You can't really see. Let me take this off. So this is the camera itself. Look at that, 1080p right now, we're recording it. Uh, it looks a lot better in person, by the way. And this is very good camera. Nearly got full percent charge. But this is going to be running off your thingy. I've set the time and date. It's very easy to use. There's a flash button. Ooh. What just happened there? Ah, oh, switch it off. Okay. So we've got uh, on uh, power. There's the LED. Turn the. It's, it's a voice recording as well, guys. So this is voice recording off. Voice recording on. It's the menu button. Uh, resolution. That's in 1080p at the moment. Loop recording, you can do that as well. That's when it runs out of space, you record in loop. And then, yeah, voice recording, date stamp, I've said that, language as well. Date and time I've done. Format, that's to format the card and you can encrypt it as well there. Uh, about product, passwords as well, you can put G-Sense on. So when you hit, get hit by a car, it'll automatically stop the recording, so you know when it's happened. Uh, parking mode, that's a parking sensor thing, very good. If you can see, you can have 60 or 50 hertz uh, time lapse record similar to the motion detection when you start the car start 
uh, driving and stuff, uh, starting it. Front LED switch, I'm not sure what that is. I saw it in the manual somewhere. How? Let me have a look. Front LED switch. Front LED switch. I was in the English section, wasn't it? Front LED switch. Anybody see it? White LED switch number 10. This one, yeah. What is it? Wait, okay. Yeah, so that's one. So basically, it's very easy to use as well. So it's on at the moment. So yeah. I think it just means that. What if I switch on the, uh, to record? You just press start. But at the moment, I need a memory card as you can see, no card inserted. To use it, you need a memory card basically. It's got two modes. That's a video mode, photo mode. And that's why. And yeah, you can change the resolution so you can get more more videos out of it. So uh, if you're not much of a high quality thing, you could use 720, it will save a lot more space. But if you're gonna put a big card in, 64 gig, I'd say go for 1080p, it'll be very, it'll be worth it. Very nice camera this is. Uh, yeah. Uh, I think you can also play back the video on here, so you can actually watch what you've recorded. Pretty damn nice, isn't it? So let me have a look here. I'm gonna switch off the front LED switch thing. Let's see if I can use it anymore. I can still use it, it doesn't make sense. What is, what is the front LED switch? No idea guys, no idea. Maybe I'll find out one day. Oopsies. some sort of lock there now I don't understand why anyways you turn it on and off like that it makes a simple noise and done look at the camera there you can actually feel the sensor going in and out you turn it on and off it's very nice there's a speaker at the back there but yeah very nice product thank you for sending me that thank you to Rich for sending this out to me I'm really really happy with it look at that just look at the front of that that's just thank you guys for watching please subscribe to my channel if you're new i'll see you next time guys